Aloha everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, hey what's up, my name is Casey. Today I am going to be doing another haul video. I know I just did one, but I am having so much fun thrifting. Um, so I went again. Today I just went to a different Goodwill, but I literally spent almost four hours, maybe more. I just have way too much fun because I don't have time to shop by myself. So now that both of my kids are in school, um, I have more like me time and I kind of just, I really love to just browse and see what I can find. Um, if you're new here, like I said, my name is Casey. I am a reseller on the Poshmark app. My Poshmark closet name is at Aloha Hanger. I will leave it linked in the, in, I will leave it linked in the description box down below. So go ahead and check out my closet if you like anything in this video. So as you can see, I have this huge Goodwill bag and I did have another bag, but I kind of took some stuff out so it'll be a little bit faster. But yeah, let's just get started. And if you guys like this sort of video, don't forget to give it a huge thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you would like to see more. Um, I definitely would like to try and grow my channel um, and do a lot of like Poshmark reselling thrift hauls, that sort of thing. So yeah, let's go ahead and get started. First thing that I picked up, in no particular order, this is um, Sack Roots bag, and that's what it looks like. It's literally in excellent condition. It has um, this little button pocket, and then it zippers, and it has the details on the zippers, and then it just opens up like that. It says Sack, sack Roots, and then this little thing says Peace. It has a zipper in there. And then it also has two little pockets here. And I just thought like the inside of the actual bag was so nice. Hopefully that's focusing. But yeah, this bag was, is literally in excellent condition. There's no scratches on it, no scuffs, no stains. It's just like a brand new little crossbody bag. Next thing I got were these pair of boots. They're really nothing special. They need to be cleaned a little bit. Um, but these are, I forgot what it's called, like textile or, yeah, it's like a textile upper kind of finish. Hopefully you guys can see that. But it's like these really like sloppy kind of distressed textile boots. Um, there is a little bit of wear to them but not anything like super significant. These are from Bear Traps and their boots kind of can run a little pricey depending on which ones you get, but I, you know what I mean? I, they weren't really that expensive, so I know I'm gonna get my monies back and um, you know, fall and winter, everybody's gonna be shopping for boots, so I thought, what the heck, I'll just pick up this pair while I'm at it. Next thing I found was so super exciting. I was like, are you, are you for real? <laughs> and um, it's these. They're not, okay, they're not that exciting. It's not that special. But these are um, from David's Bridal. And they're these crystal um, shoes. Hopefully that'll focus. So there's crystals all around it. And then it's a little peep toe. But I looked up this style. And I think they run like a little less than 50 bucks. But these guys let me just show you they're brand new and these were like three something and i looked it over none of the crystals are missing like this it's ridiculous i was like who who donated these like this would be so perfect for prom or whatever but yeah so super excited for these and then um the last pair of shoes i do need to clean but i'm super excited to post these um i found another pair of Stuart Weitzman. Um, these are these little leather, um, I guess, pointy toe pump kind of booties, but that's what that looks like. So that's what it looks like. There is like this little stuff right here. There is this stuff right here, like on the front toe part, um, but it actually just like, it's just dirty, like it comes right off. Um, but like the the bottom of the shoe, it's like pretty much brand new. There is wear on the heel padding, but other than that, um, 
these are just amazing these are a size 7 I don't know if you're gonna be able to see but it says it in there Stuart and then right there it has seven so I was really excited to find these they're in like really really good condition there's maybe like one flaw on this besides um, this dirty part right here that I can just clean but other than that these are like awesome and the guys the guy did not even charge me for the boot price he charged me for the shoe price so saved a dollar there now let's get into a majority of the things that I bought <laughs> you guys are gonna be like why um, I decided that I'm not gonna just shop for fall I want to be able to shop year-round um, because I'm from Hawaii and when I'm in Hawaii winter time all the seasons are the same okay it's it gets a little chilly but for the most part it's still hot it's still hot so people aren't gonna be wearing you know like pants boots scarves all this layering and stuff like that in Hawaii um, some do you know if they want to be cute but realistically it's just too hot so I decided I'm gonna shop year-round so, I got a bunch of shorts, guys. Like, when I say I got a bunch of shorts, I got a whole freaking bunch of shorts. Um, but, hold on, guys. I want to show you how, how much freaking shorts I got, okay? And you guys are going to be like, Casey, Casey, why? I got this much shorts, okay? But, they were in the bins. It was only like a dollar something, like I said. Um, so... You know, I'm not, and some of these are pretty good brands, so I'm not going to feel bad about buying some of shorts, you know. I'll sell them eventually. Oh, and then I also got these shorts right here. These I actually really like. Like, I wish it was my size because they just, they're so comfortable. Um, these are, let me see if that'll show up. Eliz Elizabeth by Elizabeth, no. <laughs> Elizabeth by Liz Claiborne. Um, these are a size 20. And they're just these, like, really stretchy, um, drapey shorts. And they're super pretty. They're just black with white stripes. It definitely needs to be steamed. Um, but when I saw these, especially since they're plus size, I was like, oh, yes. Yes, honey. I need them. <sighs> She's cute. Um, okay. Let's get to these shorts. I really hope I pick some good ones, but I saw these and I was like, oh my god, it's so cute, so fun. They're just like these yellow floral um, shorts, and these are, let me see, from J. Crew, and they're a size 10, excellent condition, nothing wrong with these shorts. Again, these were in the bin, so super cheap. The next ones that I got, these are so freaking fun as well. Like, look at these shorts red polka dots I know somebody's gonna fucking love this somebody's gonna love this you guys and I wish I could fit it oh actually I think I can fit it but no probably probably not but these are from Ann Taylor loft and these are a size 10 super super cute um, the pockets in the back are faux pockets so they're not functional um, but the front ones are and the zipper is totally functional I checked all the zippers on these checked every single pocket made sure that everything was good but yeah these are like in excellent condition and they're so cute I hope somebody loves these next pair I got are these shorts this is J Crew and Chino this is a size 4 and they're just these um, purple shorts but yeah there was only like one little thing right here that I need to clean off but other than that perfect pair of shorts um, I found these shorts, and this is from Loft. These are a size 2, and these are the Riv Riviera shorts. They're just this gray pair of shorts. Excellent condition. Super awesome pair of shorts. <clears throat> the next two, these are, let me see. These are from J. Crew and Chino. Super cute. Um, these are a size zero. And then I also got the exact same pair. Um, just in a bigger size. 
And these are the same, let me see, these are the same J. Crew Chino, but these are a size 12. So I'm hoping that these will sell because it is, you know, more on the plus size, and I know plus size sells really good. So I got those two pairs of shorts. The next pair, I thought these were super fun as well. They're blue um, floral pants. These are from, let me see. These are again from J. Crew. And these are a size 2. I thought these were really fun. Um, the pockets in the back are faux pockets. They are, they do have pockets on the sides though. And then it also has a zipper on the side. So you know you can squeeze into it if you need. And then it clips here so that you can zip it back up. So I thought that was pretty cool. Um, but yeah, super cute shorts. I know somebody will love them. Next pair I got, um, these are, let me see, these are from Talbots. I don't know how good this brand is, but these are the girlfriend shorts um, in a size 2P. I'm guessing that's petite, but it's just these like girlfriend jeans, I guess. Um, they were in excellent condition, no stains, no tears. The crotch area is not worn, um, and I just, I really liked the style of these, how they're like a little bit longer. I know somebody will appreciate that. Um, some, you know, some, some of us girls don't enjoy really short shorts, you know, cover it up, cover it up, girl. But yeah, these were a super good pair of jeans, so I picked those up. These shorts I almost want to keep for myself because I love green. Green is my favorite color. It's not like a super special brand, but these are from New York and Company. They are size 8. And they are these green tie-dye shorts. Look how nice that is. Um, there is no front pockets, but the print is so fun. Um, there is two back pockets with buttons. This one has the button, I just, it's just not buttoned, but the button's in there. Um, but yeah, absolutely wonderful pair of shorts. I totally want to keep it for myself, but I need to limit myself. But these are so, so nice. These were like my favorite pair I found. Next, I found these shorts, and this is J. Crew and Chino again. But the label is different, but these are a size 4. I think it says City Fit. Um, but they're just these like baby blue shorts and then these are the back of the shorts they're just really nice um, blue shorts and I know somebody will love them um, the next shorts that I got are nothing really special um, these are from white stag and they're a medium 810 and I mainly got these for me so I can do like a like a high-waisted kind of look, you know, because these are really big and long. Um, but if it doesn't work out for me, you know, I'll just let them go for cheap. This next pair is from Forever 21. I probably would not have picked this up, but it was in the bins, so it was super cheap. There was absolutely nothing wrong with these shorts. And they kind of have like a blue tie-dye, almost acid wash look to it. And they're just like regular, you know, what is this, like distressed kind of hem. But they're just like really nice shorts. And these are a US 30, really nice shorts. And then the last shorts, I really don't know much about this brand, but it's the brand Machine. And these are a size medium. Well, Italy size medium, USA size 28. They're just these like distressed um, jeans. These, of course, you know, if you want them shorter, you can totally fold them up if need be. But yeah, super cute shorts. Absolutely nothing wrong with them. Um, there's the back part. So yeah, I don't know. Just a really good pair of jeans, so I picked those up. This is the last of the stuff that I got in the bins. Um, this first one, Lane Bryant's. Um, this is a 26-28, so I believe that's plus size. It's really big, but it's just this 
um, gray shirt and it says from Miss to Mrs. So I know some some beautiful gal who's about to get married is going to love this shirt. It's in excellent condition. Um, the next thing that I got um, was from Athleta. This is a size small. Athleta seems to do really good on Poshmark, but it's just like this really light pink um, workout tank. No stains. Absolutely in really good condition. Um, yeah. So I picked that up. It also has like the little logo right there on the bottom. But yeah, I was super excited to find this. I was trying to find more, but they only had one. Next thing I got is this top from J. Crew. It is a size 10. It's just this blue um, like spaghetti strap tank. And the bottoms is gray, so it has like kind of that color blocking kind of thing. The front looks like this. It's like the V-neck. Um, has a little scrunch right here under, you know, under here. But, yeah, it's just a really nice um, tank from J. Crew, And J. Crew seems to do really good, so I picked that up. That was also in the bins. This one is actually a maternity shirt. Um, it's, let me see. It's from this brand right here. It's Oh Baby by Motherhood. Um, it was in the bins, so that's why I picked it up, but I thought some, you know, beautiful mama might like this. It, it's like a, it's like this, um, like a knit striped sweater shirt, but it's like long sleeves, and then it kind of like bells out a little bit, so it's super cute. And then it also comes with this little strap that you can tie around the waist if you want, and if not, you can just take it right off, but... You know, there was no, like, pull, like, no threads coming out of it. It wasn't threading, no pilling. It's just a really nice sweater shirt. And then the last thing I found was actually in the sleepwear um, place. But I'm pretty sure this is not sleepwear. If it is, go ahead and correct me. <laughs> but um, this is from the brand Arrow. And it's like a forest green kind of flannel shirt. It says that it was made in Egypt and this is a classic fit, extra large. So it'll be nice and you know roomy if you just want to throw it on. And you can also like button, you know, roll these up if you want. So stylish. Perfect for fall. If you button this all the way up, you can just wear some like leggings underneath. Super cute. Super cute for fall. But yeah, and then the last um, items that I found, these were not in the bins, so they were, you know, roughly a little under $5. I'm not so positive about this brand, but I want to say that it's good. Um, but this is the brand. I'm pretty sure I heard somebody talk about this before. It's Kimchi Blue, and it's made in India, but it's this super um, cute, like tube top kind of dress it has like this beautiful embellishment on it not embellishment but um I don't I don't know I don't know but look at that texture it's just so it's so nice I love the material and then it's just like a nice flowy dress and then it has like this layer of course and then underneath it has like the layer so you can't see through it but this dress was so stinking cute this is from Topshop and I can't see the size. Oh, it's a size 6. Um, but it's just like this nice kind of um, sweater shirt. But Topshop does really good on Poshmark, I believe. And it's perfect, you know, with it getting cold. Next thing I got is this dress. And it's from J. Crew. It is a size medium. And it's just this black and um, like metallic gold, uh, metallic silver uh, sweater dress. There was some kind of like something on it, but I figured if I like give it a good wash, it'll come off. But it was so cheap, and J. Crew does really good. So with fall coming up, winter, I thought that this would be a really good sell. Next thing I got. Uh, was this jacket and 
This is from J. Crew as well. J. Crew Collection. It is a size um, medium. And the only reason why I picked this baby up is because, guys, when I tell you, when I tell you, this thing is so soft. Like, there's no stains on it. I love that it comes with a hood. It's light enough to wear, like, as a, like, a, sh a sweater shirt kind of thing if you want. Um, but it's, uh, let me see, what did it say? It's Italian cashmere. And, y'all, you know I'm poor when I've never felt cashmere before. So, this feels really good. Um, and I was excited to find that. So, I picked that up. The next thing I found um, is this sweater. It's a knit sweater. It's a jegging, jegging sweater from American Eagle Outfitters. It's a size extra small. This thing literally is brand new. Like, it should have had a tag on it because it's not stretched out whatsoever um no stains like no like pulling or anything on the the entire sweater like it's just in excellent condition so i'm surprised it does not have a tag on it but this thing was just so pretty so perfect for fall Oh, this was a good find. This was an exciting find. Um, this is from LuLaRoe. Never bought anything from LuLaRoe. It is a size small, but the only reason why I picked it up is because it was new with tags. Um, and the, the shoulder parts have like almost like a gold or like copper reflex in them, just the sleeves. And then the rest of it is just a plain black dress. And y'all know LuLaRoe is soft. So, knew it tags. I was there for it. And then, two more things. This, this dress that I got is from J. Jill. I don't know how good her brand is, but I picked it up. This is a size small. Small petite. And it is a denim dress it's soft it has like the buttoning here buttoning on the sleeves absolutely nothing wrong with this dress um, it does also have pockets who doesn't love a dress with some pockets I, I know I do but um yeah I picked this up and I thought you know with denim coming back um, I thought this would be a good sell and then for the last item that I picked up, I was so excited to find this, you guys. It's from Maeve. I see so many people talk about this. This is a size 2, and it's like a corduroy dress. I'm going to show you guys. Hopefully you guys can see the, like, the detail in the material. It has a bit of like a corduroy, corduroy kind of feel. Um, but it's this beautiful like orange orange dress it has like these quarter sleeves with the little buttons and then it has the buttons going down the dress as well and all the buttons are there they're just like on the inside but these this has pockets as well everybody loves a dress with pockets and it's Maeve and it's in excellent condition it feels so nice but yeah you guys I was so excited for this I found my first Maeve dress and honestly, this color is just so perfect for fall. And I realized I forgot to mention one more shorts. Hello. Um, these shorts I was really excited for. I found them in the bins as well with all the other shorts. And I've heard, I've heard about this brand. So when I found it, I was really, really so excited. Um, this, let me see if I can show it. Pilcro and the letter press. Hopefully you guys can. And these are the hyphen size 31. But um, they're just like these super cute, bright, like blood orange. It's probably picking up orange, but these are like a blood orange kind of shorts. Has pockets on the front and the back. And then right there in the back, it says Pilcro and the letter press. But yeah, you guys, that is everything from my Goodwill haul today. I 
put them all in a pile right here next to me and legit you guys legit I got so much stuff I I feel like I got some pretty good stuff for the price um, but yeah I hope you guys enjoyed this haul video and if y'all enjoy me please subscribe to my channel I would totally appreciate that become a part of my little ohana and yeah if you guys love Poshmark and thrifting and hauls and just all that kind of stuff totally subscribe if you guys have any like questions about things or you guys want to request anything from me go ahead leave it down in the comments below i hope you guys are having a great day or night wherever you guys are and until next time i'll see you guys in my next video aloha